Today we're comparing the different Hero 5 Black settings, 1080p, 2.7k, and all the different frame rate settings. We'll also check out the different ProTune colors, Flat, GoPro Color, and Default Color. In this clip we can see true 1080p quality at 60 frames per second. Now at this clip increased to 120 frames per second, we can see in the top left corner a big drop in resolution. Here we can see a 2.7K resolution clip recorded at 60 frames per second. Not a whole lot different than 1080p. Here we can see a direct comparison of three different videos, 30, 60, and 120 frames per second side by side. Now we can see the individual clips slow down to half speed and a quarter speed. We can see that the 120 frame per second clip is a lot smoother than the 30 or 60 frame per second clips. The downside is a loss in quality. Here we can test 2.7K and 1080p side by side and zoomed in. When rendered in 2.7K quality, the 2.7K image looks a lot smoother and clearer than the 1080p image. And here we can see four different images, 30, 60, 90, and 120 frames per second lined up. Note that the 120 frame per second and 90 frame per second images, the quality is worse. Stick with 60 frame per second or 30 frame per second when you're shooting your clips. Here we will move on and see the different colors that you can record with using ProTune. On the left, we have GoPro color. In the middle, we have default color. And on the right, we have flat. As you can tell, GoPro color is a little more vibrant than the default color setting. And flat just allows you to add color in post editing. I recommend using GoPro color whenever you're shooting your everyday clips. Hopefully this video gave you guys a better understanding about how the different settings can be used for different purposes while you record. Please drop a like if you guys enjoyed the video, share it around, show it to your friends. Yeah, thanks for watching guys. Hit that subscribe button if you want and have a good day.